In this boxcar press instructional video, we'll discuss make ready, um, which is really good for evening out impression, particularly on flattened presses. First, let's pull an impression and see what our printing looks like. You'll notice that the ink is heavier on the top of our sheet where the plate is very narrow. We know that this isn't an inking problem because we've checked our roller height and roller condition. Many forms will have an uneven impression because of the deflection of the platen when it impacts the form. Larger areas of printing inevitably need more pressure to print than smaller areas. In this case, the narrow areas at the top of the leaf are printing more darkly than the broad areas in the middle. The middle needs more pressure to print evenly. We'll draw circles around the light areas, in this case identifying what areas need a little bit more impression or what areas need a lot more impression. These will correspond with one or two thicknesses of tissue behind the middle of the leaf in order to give it more pressure. We'll place the tissue over the lines we've drawn and use an X-Acto knife to cut these out to size. A dab of glue will hold these two tissues together in relation to each other. Then we'll tape this make ready over the press sheet. Now we'll drop the press sheet into the gauge pins on the press and stab through the tissues, the press sheet, the draw sheet, all the way down to the make ready sheet that's on top of our press packing. We'll make three V's in the tissue. These will help us align the tissue to the make ready sheet so that we can mount it inside the packing. Note the three V's through the tissue. Then we'll open the top bale and see that our V's have marked the make ready sheet. We can use these to align our tissue make ready behind the draw sheet. We'll tape this to the make ready sheet, making sure that the tape is not underneath the printing area. We then take our press packing and position this in front of the make ready sheet burying the make ready deep within the packing. By burying the make ready, we'll make sure that the tissue's cut edges are imperceptible on the printed sheet. Reattach the top bale, tape down the V's where they might obstruct feeding, and pull another impression. You can see now that the color is more uniform overall on the leaf, thanks to the extra pressure we've applied in the middle with our tissues. If you find you have to apply Make Ready frequently to the same area of the platen, for instance, if one corner always has too little impression, it may be time to adjust your platen bolts. Loosen the lock nut at that corner, adjust the platen bolt, and retighten. Once Make Ready is done, it's time to get down to printing. 